YouTube, it's your boy Mixtagger here, and welcome back to Hearts of Iron 4. Now, I sped it up just a tiny bit to make us get a little bit closer to our war and making our progress through the western side of the states here. Now, a couple of developments happen uh, in the meantime, so the armor effect got finished, the special forces. Uh, finished and now I'm gonna go on to paramilitarism to decrease the division time and a bunch of research also happened on the back end where um, the support weapons and the improved inventory got uh, done and then the um, industry got researched while the um, I believe it was this guy got researched which helps research time so yeah now that we've got that going on I also moved around some factories to get more tanks more airplanes and our, our resources are pretty even right now so now that that's good to go we can um, now just hope for the best because um, I kind of want to stop trading oh I've got more factories I can trade now Ooh, that means I can uh, trade so that I can generate uh, more stuff but I'm low on manpower but that's okay as we move forward um, we're gonna get the submachine gun and then support improved and then I'm thinking I'm gonna get all these guys down here once this is done and then I th I definitely would like to get all these guys researched in due time um, I should also get these tanks researched and then uh, artillery and we should also start thinking about our sh our navy and then um, also our aircraft as we are way behind on all of those so but yeah we're just gonna mosey on forward and take a look at our wonderful overlord Bob Brown look at this guy look at this dude what a guy pushing all that fascism for our Ohio Reich. Um, where'd that manpower come from? I have no idea. Um, so this is also a thing I want to finish so that I, I can also increase our conscription. And this one increases training time actually, so cancel this out. And we can increase our manpower by 5%. And 5% of whatever 112,000 is, is should be a decent amount. No. I think 1% is, is just a hundredth of a thing. So this would be 100,000 divided by 100. So that would be just a hundred. Or no, it'd be a thousand. It'd be a thousand, and then um, times five, so five thousand extra manpower going towards whatever, roughly. So, so we've got oil on the way, which also increases our rubber production. So that's where this rubber is coming from, and once we increase this to eight, we can stop trading. Uh, one factory and then it'll get consumed up but we got quite a ways until this construction finishes so we've got um, five six seven of those on the way so I definitely want one extra one somewhere uh, uh, how many can I make quite a few but I want to yeah, let's actually let's go with oil everywhere. Oil everywhere. 
Yes, sir. And then um, I should also increase um, our naval capacity here. Boom. And then let's go with the civilian here all over the place. Looks like I can get quite a lot of those. So let's actually just let's pump out construction facilities and then get this uh, oil on the way. So I want to, uh, I need to move one of these up. So let's move this one up so that I can get seven on the way. Eh, come on, move. Yeah, there we go. And that way the infrastructure is still being made and then I should get plenty of oil. And once that's all made, I can stop trading. And then the same goes with um, the steel. Once we take over Tennessee, we won't have to trade our factories for that anymore. Oh, so I guess I can trade factories for rubber quite a lot and um, only one for the aluminum. Oh, what about this one? 123, damn. Okay, so that wouldn't be too bad, actually. So, if I wanted to make, um, what is it, the, the artillery, then um, I could, I would just need to trade. I would need to decrease one of these. So let's go boop. And then move this guy up. And then decrease this guy by one. Boom. And now let's trade for one. And then it should. Yep, there we go. So now we've got our artillery and I guess we can increase this quite a bit so um, uh, two a week I mean that's not too bad so let's go with this then well we actually only need like not that many artillery uh, but it looks like our steel is low so Granada okay um I guess that's something I can't do quite yet so let's decrease this and then increase this guy so I think we need more support equipment if I'm gonna be honest Why are you so low? Okay. Um, so just decrease this. What can I increase then? I can increase the bomber by two. And then we're good to go. So now we've got artillery on the way. We've already got eight. Interesting. <laughs> All right, cool. So how is the war looking? Um, well, I don't know. Since the game's taking forever, I can't tell. Uh, we've got about 30 days left until our long-awaited war. Um, it looks like we got ourselves some more units. Join the regiment. Yes. And then now we've got 16 of 24. All right, improved machine stiffs. Now let's get the next one. 
boom. And that should increase our production to the current maximum for 1940 at least. So that should take up to so that should take until 1941 actually. So our next research should be this one then. And then go with this. And uh, I can also increase the output of the oil and rubber. Interesting. Construction. Man, we have so much stuff to research. Resource gain efficiency for what? Uh, I don't know. I don't know. Either way, we've got lots of research ahead of us. So, oh, looks like our supported support weapons are almost done. Cool. Lots of good upgrades coming our way. Um, and our production is looking absolutely monstrous. Let's see here. Um, there we go. So now with that researched, 1940 is the next one. So let's actually get uh, better motorized vehicles. And that way our motorized vehicles should move faster, mobilize faster. Um, and our army will truly look like a monster. Mechanical. Man, we got so much stuff. So much stuff. So, what's this? Is this like a special unit or something? Um, cool. So, I guess that would be... So what's the difference between this and this? This one is better defense and organization. And this one is capacity division. Ah, uh, I'd rather have better of this. Oh, wow, holy crap. 20, 20, 50, 50. Yeah, I think this top line is much better. Um, oh, hey, more units. Hello. You came out of nowhere. Oh, it's the tanks. Cool. Cool beans. So now we're <laughs> low on manpower. Um. I'm actually wondering where my, uh, my military experience went since this got. Oh no, that that doesn't grant anything. It just uh, special forces capacity multiplier. Okay. Um. So after this, I'm gonna go for aviation, and then um, aviation because we're not gonna really go across sea quite yet because we can basically capture all of this before we even think about going in overseas um okay 10 days and so once we get to overseas is when we can start researching all that fun jazz but we are making a pretty good um Pretty good, uh, what is it, um, shoot, I lost my train of thought, good progress, um, through all, all of these, so, yeah, um, Minister Alabama, you've got it coming towards you, because you will no longer exist in the next 20 days, yes, 20 days indeed. So 
I have a crap ton of units now. So I've got uh, got infantry with motorized basically everywhere, and then the tank is at the top. Cool. So I've got quite the sizable army. Now I keep checking these guys. They don't have any units. Uh, but what in the world is this? They've got. They've been producing a lot of steel. Interesting. Okay. I'll take your steel, Mr. Tennessee. And you have been producing nothing. Z zero. Nada. Nothing. Nothing at all. You gotta be joking me, man. Well, at least you've got manpower just for me. Uh, so, yeah, you, you're you useless, Alabama. Absolutely useless. So is Kentucky. It's got nothing. It's got some factories, though. I'll take those factories. That's for sure. I've got some convoys, but man, look at me. Boom, look at all this crap. Alright, cool. War. Oh, uh, man. What happened? Declare war. Boom. Yeah. Justify war goal. Okay, looks like that's just going to take a long time. So we're almost... We're going to get Alabama and Tennessee this time. I wonder if it's going to be like that for, for the rest of the game. I don't know. Maybe it's just a state or something. Yeah. Okay. So now that paramilitarism is done, what's this do? Uh, this increases war support, division attack, division defense, and allows me to create factions. That's actually pretty useful. I'll take that. And then now that uh, that's been researched, extensive conscription, and boom. Now our manpower should increase by a ton. Well, not a ton, but a decent amount. Um, 113,000. Oh, yep, there it is. Boom, 5,000. Are you going there? Man, all these units are taking forever. You go up there. Damn, holy crap, that was so fast. going up there go over there oh so many freaking factories let's go can I declare whoa with uh, someone in France Moslem Thessaly I have no idea where any of that is But, let's see, yeah, a whole year just to freaking declare war on these guys. Ridiculous. Alright, now everyone, everyone, just go here. Boom. And conquered. Hell yeah. Capitulate. Yes, sir. Conquer. End of turn. Done. Seized. Pause. Get these guys on the Tennessee border. Get them to up. Oh, shoot. Crap, I need to erase that. In. Yep, there we go. And across. Boom. 
Now that should have given me a ton of stuff. Well, not a ton of stuff, just a couple factories and some extra stuff. So, can I increase, I can increase motorized by a little bit. Is that it? I guess so. I've got three factories to, I guess I'm going with bomber, because that seems the only one that I can increase and do convoys. I can't do anything else, so one convoy. <laughs> um, otherwise, I'm using too much resources. Yeah, so let's just leave it at that. Boom. Is everyone on their way? Yes, they are. So, Georgia, what are your resources? Uh, you have none. Cool. Very cool. Alright. Um, so now, we just wait for the war with Tennessee, which is in another 15 days. Um, and then the rest of this stuff will have to, to wait, I guess. Ooh, a ship. Uh, you. Um, where can I go? Can you? Uh, I don't know. I need you to join one of these fleets. Let's go with this one. You go here. But you already have two. What about you? Do you have anything? Only one, okay. Yeah, just go back to base. And then we can add this fleet to them. And then, um, we can have two on each of these and have our uh, seas covered, essentially. Okay, so now that they're back, I need to shift click and then drag and drop. Drag and drop. Yep, there we go. And then I need you to patrol. Boop, boop, boop. Uh, boop, 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 boop. Wah, wah. Come on now. There we go. Holy crap, that was kind of annoying. Uh. You, why don't you just go away? Can I... What is this? Can I... Can I disband you? Are you sure you want to understand? Uh, uh yes. Trash. Yes. Disband the stupid marines. We're not using them. Alright, so now with more manpower, we should be getting more units. And with more units, we can take over for more stuff. Hell yeah. And then this will start becoming more like a, just one big, friendly... Uh, I, I, I say friendly while I take over the world, but one unified unit. I really, this is looking kind of bad. I don't like this. So, uh, I'm, 
All right, cool. So our justification is now ready. So now let's go after Georgia. And now it'll be to Kentucky and Georgia on the next episode. But for now, let's just get us through Tennessee. And and take them over, essentially. Yeah, this is easy. They aren't even putting up a fight. Yep, just get in there. Just mosey on in. Easy money. And three, two, one. Capitulate. They didn't capitulate. All right, one more to go. One more to go. Yep, there we go. And capitulate. I just got a crap ton of resources. So now, get you up to Kentucky. And then just go to where the borders are not connected. Boom. Now that we've got resources, we have so many resources. Granada, stop trading with me. I don't need you anymore. Stop trading. There we go. Boom. Now that we have Tennessee, we... Uh, I already did this. Come on. Quit being so slow, game. So much manpower. Like low manpower, my butt. Don't you dare tell me that. Alright, so now in the next episode, what are you telling me to do? Don't tell me to do things. You have relations with who now? Uh huh, whatever. With who? Tell me, tell me who, warrior? I don't even know what those places are. Whatever, man. I don't even care. But uh, yeah, in the next episode, we will be taking over Kentucky, Georgia, and then we shall see about the rest of these states. So. Thank you all for watching, and I will see you in the next video. Bye-bye.